Good evening, my fellow SDR people on the internet. I just wanted to show you how to get the maximum performance from your SDR. Uh, I am using SDR Uno as the software, and I have it connected to a RSP2 Pro. And the best part is what I've just constructed which is my homemade one meter diameter copper loop antenna. As you can see, it's basically just three meters of 19 millimeter copper that came as a tube, which I opened up and brought it down to a rather large surplus capacitor, three gain capacitor that I had. And I have a switch to turn the capacitor in the circuit or out of the circuit, and a knob to tune it. And of course, a good old PVC base to hold it, which I can dismantle and throw it in the back of my car. Now, I'm going to show you the difference in signal. I will turn the capacitor off, take it out of the circuit. It's no longer in the circuit. And I will show you what my 9.5 megahertz band looks like. I will turn the volume up. All you can hear is static. Now I'm going to walk over, unfortunately, I have to go. And I will turn the capacitor into the circuit and watch what happens to the signal. Listen. Okay, you can see the difference having a capacitor in a tuned circuit makes. Now, I will actually tune the capacitor a little bit off-center so you can see what happens to the signal. Now I'm going to tune the capacitor a little bit to the left and you can see it goes off band and there is absolutely nothing. I will bring the capacitor in closer to the band. You will see a huge peak. If you keep going you get too much noise. That's actually the, the peak but I go a little bit off peak. Bring it down to about there and just flatten it a little bit and you can see you get an incredibly good signal on shortwave uh, crystal clear this is radio china and i'm in australia <laughs> and uh, again it's all due to the uh, loop antenna and again i'll take the capacitor out of the circuit Watch the signal. Nothing but noise. Bring the capacitor in. Wow. So it's really an incredible um, antenna for indoor listening. As you can see, I'm in my bedroom. I do have a window facing out. Uh, the antenna is PVC down the bottom to hold it up. Pipe stuck together. 3 meters of 12 millimeter copper tubing in a loop and a great big 3 gain capacitor stuck in the middle with a switch to take it in the circuit and out of the circuit and a knob. Uh, I still have a bit of experimenting to do with the coupling. That's actually 75 ohm cable which is not ideal and it's not even the right size. I will experiment a little bit more to get a optimal cable set up for picking up the signal but as you can see it's just in my bedroom and uh, it works incredibly well the signal is just incredible booming incredible boom i'll just take it out so you can hear the difference 
Very clear. You know, the capacitor out of the circuit, all you get is noise. Now, if this radio antenna was actually out in the backyard, I'd have to uh, do something to attenuate the signal that becomes so powerful. Thank you for watching, and I hope you can make one and get the same kind of results. Goodbye from lovely Australia.